Hi, I am Nick Minacucci from North Main Music, and I'm here to teach you guys about some classical guitar technique. So first things first, okay, we're going to talk about the right hand. Now on the right hand, you only use four out of your five fingers whenever you're playing the classical guitar. That, and those four fingers are your thumb, your index finger, your middle finger, and your ring finger. And what we're going to do with those four fingers is we are going to first assign them numbers. Okay, Your thumb is finger number one. Your index finger is finger number two, middle is three, and ring is four. And we are going to put each one of those fingers on one of the four strings in the top uh, um, string sets on the guitar. Um, so just like so, thumb on the fourth, um, index on the third, middle on the second, and ring on the first. And once we've established that, okay, we, can, uh, we need to break away from the guitar for a second. All right, we'll grab a piece of paper and a pen, and we're going to chart out every single possible, every single picking pattern, um, every possible picking pattern that you can play with those four fingers on those four strings. And you can chart it out just like this into four columns. The first column being all of the picking patterns that start with your first finger. The second, all those that start with your second. Third, all those that start with your third, and then finally all those that start with your fourth. So once we have these charted out, make sure you put it in a place where you can see it. And we're going to start doing various exercises with all of these patterns. Okay? So starting with the first one, okay, it's simple. It's just your thumb or one, two, three, and then four. So you're just going to play them right in order. All right? Now what's important is that is when you play the string, you mute the string um, with the same finger that you played it with, like so. Okay, and then you're going to play the picking pattern and do that for each string. So once you've first done that, okay, the first step is then to just play that picking pattern over and over and over again until it starts to feel comfortable. All right, so once we've gotten there, now, we can start to move on down the column. So the next picking pattern, instead of one, two, four, three, four, it's one, two, four, three. So let's try that one out. All right, so now that we've accomplished the first two picking patterns, we can try and combine them into one exercise. Um, so let's just do four times through the first picking pattern, and then four times through the second picking pattern. Okay, so now, once we've done that, we can continue to move our way down the column. Now repeat the same steps for each picking pattern in each column, okay? So you're going to learn this one separately, learn this one separately, this one separately, this one, this one, this one, all right? And then you're going to combine them in groups of twos all the way down, just like I did there with the first two. Now, once you've done that, okay, you could even take that further and combine them into groups of threes, um, groups of fours, all right? However you want to do that, that's your choice. Um, but usually what I do for the next step is to try and just play down the whole column, all right? You just start at the beginning, play that once, and then move right on to the next one, okay? And get from start to finish. It'll sound and look something like this. Okay? And finally, once you've done that, then you can repeat all of the steps for each and every column. Now, once you've gotten there, then you can try and take it even further, okay? And instead of doing the muted notes, just play, just let them sustain, okay? So once you've done that, okay, then you can do that for each column, and before you know it, you will be playing classical guitar better than you ever have before, I promise. Um, all right, so that's about it for me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this lesson, and I hope that you learned a lot from it. 
Um, and I'm Nick Minacucci, and I will see you down at North Main Music. Thank you.